Rescuers spent the day transporting dogs from this Tate County property. Those we talked to said the condition those animals were living in was tough to see. Hair severely matted, some badly shaking, these small dogs of various breeds are getting a second chance at life. When you see dogs living this kind of life, you know, when they deserve so much more, it's it's just heartbreaking. It shatters you. Some still in the beginning stages of life. We were there as dogs were removed from a Tate County property off East Tate Road. Sandy Williams, director of the Tunica Humane Society, says the rescue started with a tip about a week ago. I get a lot of tips, but this one seemed to really have some teeth in it. Did some undercover work um, to try to put it together. Deputies with the Tate County Sheriff's Office executed a search warrant this morning. Initially, they thought there were more than 200 dogs on the property, but say that number is actually around 170. Uh, it is definitely a full-blown puppy mill. Um, some of the dogs are in just horrific shape. The ammonia level was almost unbreathable. Because of that, they're calling the raid Operation Breathe. Because when those dogs came out of that building, they got their first breath of fresh air probably uh, in their lives. 102 dogs removed from one small outbuilding alone. Uh, kennels just stacked on top of each other. The Tunica Humane Society is now working with Sunny Meadows to get these dogs back to a normal life. And so we need to raise a lot of funds to give these animals the vet care they deserve. They all need to be groomed, cleaned up. Um, I'm sure they have all kinds of health issues. In Tate County, Shea Arthur, WREG News Channel 3.